all right what's going on guys i'm back with another video but before we get into this video don't forget to smash that like button we aim it for 100 likes on this video don't forget to comment like and subscribe to turn on that post notification notification bell icon so you know when i upload to this channel and get all the latest announcement with all the aimbot scripts um just any script period in this video we're going to be taking a look at the crescent aimbot script or that's known as perfect aim edition script that was my last video I upload to the channel it was about like two days ago and i thought i'd just like play a couple games and get a full feel of this script and what we're gonna be doing is we're just gonna be taking a look at the mods that come in this script obviously if you downloaded this script you will see on the zen that it does not show any led oh you know it don't show that on the um on the zen at all so basically all you gotta do is turn on this script and then read the directions that they give you on the website in order to activate different mods such as rapid fire um to disable mods you know stuff like that and the best thing i like about this script is how easy it is to set up the recording that is the best thing about this script versus the Taylor Drift script where you have to do everything like manually even though you have to do this manually but you don't have to punch in any numbers basically you just go in a private match aim at the wall shoot a couple times let it calibrate then shoot again use your thumbsticks to navigate where you want the recoil to go that is to me that is man that is outstanding and it's just much easier to do it that way in order uh, rather than doing a horizontal vertical this that and that that and this no nah, this is way easier and since we're comparing the two from the aim assist i'm just going ahead and say that to me the this this script right here like i said right now is kind of beating Taylor drifts even though i think they all worked on it together but to me this script is like much smoother i don't know because like i was playing for with taylor drift's script for like maybe a whole day i got off i got back on and it seemed like my game was lagging or something i don't know if it was the zen or what but like if i move my screen left and right it's like you get a little bit of bugginess to it i i don't know but ever since i've been using the crescent script it been smooth as shit like from aiming as you can see in this video i mean it ain't the best gameplay but it's something and it was it was doing pretty good to me and also also i just want to say this um video was recording uh the theater i've been you know utilizing the theater since we got it back now instead of recording gameplay live i just go back and go in the theater and then record some good gameplay but like i was saying about this script uh it's, it's a good script and although you have to really learn it and you have to because you can't see anything so it's like you can't see anything on the led so that's a that's like one of the downfalls of this script but other than that i have no complaints about this script this script is amazing um i mean even though they worked on it together i understand that but still this script is nice and that's basically all I got to say about it. And I would recommend anybody to use this script, to be honest. But right now, this is a script I'm going to be using. And you might see more gameplay of this script. Let me know in the comments below if you need any help adding this script to your Zen. Or want me to release a video on how to add scripts to the Zen. It's real easy. I mean, it's, it's not that hard. But just let me know. And I'm just going to let y'all finish watching this game. But I just want to give y'all a quick update on how this script is. How it works. And also, this has does have an auto run feature. So you don't have to keep on clicking the button. So that's already enabled once you turn on the script. And I like that. And then if you click it, you can... Uh, if you click the run thing, it's gonna slide cancel for you. And if you click the right analog, it will duck. And you will see that a couple times in um, 
in this video and saved my life. You know what I mean? So this this has some good features in it, and like I said, I like it. I give it a, a ten out of ten. Well, matter of fact, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep it 100. I'm giving it a nine out of ten, and then that ten, I mean that minus one, has come from the LED. You don't got no LED. You can't see like virtually what you're doing with the mod. But other than that, everything is uh, magnificent. I like it. So yeah, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. We releasing videos nonstop. I took like a one day break. I had to, but because I, I was going hard all week. We're talking about all week. So we back on the road. We finna keep on going up. Uh, man, I appreciate all the subscribers that I've been getting. It's been going up crazy nonstop. We heading for that 9,000 subscribers. Don't forget to subscribe. Appreciate you stopping through. See y'all in the next one. Peace.